Hey there guys, it's Aero Dragon. welcome back, and today I'll be doing an update on my Lysorn Twilight Slash Perform H uh, deck profile uh, for you guys. So, uh, for this, um, I do have a couple of things to mention and, you know, like, my thoughts about it. But, yeah, do you guys feel that Lysorns might make a comeback if the Xyz version of Minerva, the rank 4 one, uh, which is a YCS uh, promo, what if that came out reprinted? kind of like in next year's uh premium gold because this year's premium gold uh we got the i think the heavy king industry or something like that and then we also got the number 106 giant hand um which was price cards before but before that we got the um legendary dragon of white and uh, legendary magician of dark or something like that uh but those were non-playable but they were also price cards so i'm just wondering what if minerva is in the like upcoming series of cards to be reprinted from worlds um and i think its partner would be like um probably like um ascension maybe because uh dragon or sky dragon ascension or something like that uh it's a pretty pretty strong card um not gonna lie uh, but that card is also uh like i think it hasn't been reprinted as much uh, but I seen it in Super Rare, but then that's like the World Championship and stuff. But yeah, I wonder if it's gonna be those two that will be getting it reprint next. But yeah, with further ado, um, putting that all aside, let's get down to the deck profile and show you guys what I should play in the deck and my reasonings why. All right, so we got three Judgment Dragons. He's the boss of the deck, uh, alongside other cards as well. But um, main boss. You have four different names of Lightstorm monsters in your graveyard. Pop it onto the field. Pay a thousand. Destroy all cards except for him. Really amazing. Your uh, mill power uh, is Raiden right here. Triple Raiden. Uh, he's also a level 4 tuner. Um, kind of a little Easter egg. You guys can see that it's a warrior tuner. But it's not a warrior effect tuner. So the first editions Raiden. Um, I think they're like... They have this like misprint where it doesn't say effect, uh, but I think the reprinted structure deck, which is the unlimited version, is too. So that's pretty cool. Like um, some cases of uh, like missing text are like this, and I think in um, Duelist Alliance Baxia when they spelled synchro, it doesn't have the H with it, so it's like synchro. So that's kind of funny. I was like, okay, but yeah. Um, some little Easter eggs that you guys might not know. Now you know. Uh, let's see. So we got the triple Lumina, uh, call haunted. You know, for days. Uh, discard one card. You can discard like a copy of herself. Bring her back. Discard another. Bring her back. Or um, you know, just do the loop. I guess um, what I usually tell people, like if I have like Luminas, two Luminas in my hand and one Lumina in the graveyard, I'll just loop for days. Alright, continuing on, uh, two Minervas, uh, just give you more uh, milling power, I guess. Uh, Airhen, uh, kick those defensive monsters back into the deck. You know, it could be sometimes a uh, problem, like for your board, I guess. I can't think of any cards that would be a problem in defense mode. Mm, maybe Diamond Crack King, but then I don't really see that as much. Um, Maybe Ghost Tricks, maybe you can like hit them back and you know they can't activate their effects. I don't know, something like that. Anyways, Felis, uh, Light Sworn Archer, you tribute her, uh, you can pop a card. Um, Wolf, everyone knows Wolf, you know, it sucks to draw him, like literally sucks to draw him. And then one Lila, uh, pop back row. And yeah, that's it for all the Light Sworns. Uh, two Hat Triggers. For the perform H engine, and then also one trick clown. Trick clown is just there, uh, you know, for me to go into my rank fours or go into my synchro plays, and it's really easy to get out because of the milling uh, going on in the deck. So really, really good. And then of course it is a twilight deck, so three necrogarnas, two shadow dragons. Uh, for people that keep asking me like questions on why I play the Shadow Dragons, it's because it has two pretty good effects. One, you can set it, and then you know it can bounce back if it's flipped, or if this card is sent to the graveyard by a card effect, uh, you can pop a spell or trap card on your opponent's side of the field. So it's either a Compulse or an MST kind of. 
and then BLS, uh, Chaos Sorcerer, uh, Electric Magnetic Turtle, which is a really nice card. Uh, kind of like a negate attack, but then a monster version of it. Uh, one Honest to get over any cards that might be higher than the 3000. Uh, Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit, just to clear um, board and everything. Or it could be used as a tuner as well. And then for spells, I play 3 Solar Recharge, 2 Treasure Light Brigade, uh, my Twin Twister fell. So 2 Twin Twisters, um, most of the time you want your combo pieces in your hand, but if, uh, for example, if you draw Felis or if you draw a Wolf and you can't get rid of them and you do want them in the graveyard, uh, Twin Twisters um, allow you to do that. So you're discarding a card that you don't need for you know something that you can get an advantage of. Or if you have BLS in your hand and you need a Dark Titan monster in your hand or in your graveyard, uh, you can discard it using Twin Twisters Effect, Summon BLS. Uh, and I play one Dark Hole, uh, one Book of Moon, and two Monster Reincarnation, just in case if you want to bring anything back from the graveyard into your hand. Alright. Uh, for the extra deck, play Castell, Diamond Dire Wolf. Number 50, uh, Black Ship of Corn. This card's really good because it does not um, destroy the target or banish it. It simply just sends the card to the graveyard and then your opponent takes a thousand damage. Uh, but the monster attack has to be lower than 2100, so that's another thing. Uh, the Star Leech you got here, um, kind of like Giant Hand, uh, but then better in my opinion. Basically, if you um, destroy him and then you get a free card, you get a free draw. So that's pretty nice. Uh, cowboy for game. You know, still going to get that cowboy. Really useful. Uh, Bujite Tsukiyomi. So he's like the draw power of the deck. And he also helps you mill cards from your hand. Um, but otherwise, really good card. Number 101, Silent Honor Arc. Number 82, Harlan Draco to attack directly. And for the Synchros, I play two uh, Michaels. One Black Rose Moonlight, one Black Rose, which is the original. Crimson Blader helps a lot if you can lock your opponent out. Starter's Dragon, and then Leo the Keeper of the Sacred Tree. So yeah, guys, that is it for my deck profile. If you have any questions on the deck profile and why I run these cards, uh, let me know down below in the comments. I know there's been some cards last time and I forgot to take them out, such as Bills. And people were commenting, like, you know, why do you play that card when we don't have a Dark Tuner? I'm like, oh, that's probably like, you know, I forgot to take it out because uh, back then I used to side in Plague Spreader Zombie, uh, which was a really good card at the time, too, uh, where you can just um, synchro into Bills and then, you know, just have it guard your field. But then I don't really play that anymore because it was too slow. I felt like Plague Spreader uh, kind of like make the deck a little bit or made the deck uh, feel slow. So I just took it out and I was like, you know, I'll fix it. And I just um, added new cards to it. So guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, share, subscribe, comment, and check out my other videos too. Um, I try to post them like, you know, once every uh, couple of days now because I have college, but at least two videos per week, hopefully. And I do plan on getting a new camera. I know, uh, you know, I'm still like in like, the movie theaters with the black screens, you know that kind of deal it's kind of funny how my friends um kept telling me that it's like dude you need to upgrade your camera and i know i need to but you guys thank you for watching again uh, this is arrow dragon and i am signing out